so I am at my British bakery and I'm so happy that I could make it here um, I just finished having a business meeting and I was in Yaba I'm like if you're in Yaba why not just come to my British bakery it is so colorful everything are red 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 fire <laughs> you guys they have different types of bread they have chocolate bread they have chicken bread they have sardine bread and they have coconut bread they have so many other types but those are the ones i bought i also bought ewa going and um i bought diced beef and pomo so that's 800 naira and then the ewa going and i can't wait to dig in and it comes with bread too so this is extra bread i'm taking home with the bread that's coming with my meal and one um coconut bread which one be chicken bread is okay. chicken is inside do you have it okay okay so that's what i want to buy People don't sell the ewa going that we used to eat the bread. You sell it? Are you serious? Bring one ewa going and one diced beef and koma. It comes with bread. Which bread? Okay. All right. Sarah has been cranky, cranky girl, cranky. <laughs> but this place is so colorful, so I'm sure that's why she's not cranky anymore. And I'm feeling the lighting in this place, like it's very, like it's very flattering. I like it, so I like the plants there. I'm feeling it. Anyways, um, we're waiting for our meal. The our going is not available. So I'm going to be having the pepper pomo, pepper beef and pomo. So there's no ever going for today. Anyways, no problem. We're just going to eat whatever is available. I'm back home now and I bought four loaves of bread. The loaf 
I'm very curious about is this chicken loaf. I've never really seen chicken inside bread, except as a sandwich, but not like baked in your bread. So I'm really curious about it. Um, also, there's the chocolate loaf. This is it. Um, I feel like I know what chocolate loaf would taste like, but I would really also want to taste this one. And then the sardine loaf. We have a bakery close to us and they make sardine loaves and I really, 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 really like sardine bread. I can just sit down and finish a whole loaf by myself. Don't judge me. <laughs> and then last but not least, we have the coconut bread. Would it be a bread review if I didn't pick the coconut one? You guys know I love coconut flavor. I do a lot of coconut rice, coconut anything. You catch me there. I'm surprised they didn't have the suya, <laughs> suya loaf. Take my work very, very seriously. I'm here with bread knife and a plate. So I'm just going to be taking slices. So this is what the chicken loaf looks like. <laughs> okay. This is the bit of chicken. I can find in the chicken loaf. Let's do a test test. Mm. You guys, this bread is so soft. I wish there was a lot of chicken, but this bread is so soft. This whole loaf. No, I love this bread. Just that. Just one bit of chicken there. This is the chocolate bread. It looks like bread you want to dip in hot cocoa tea. It has like chocolate here in the middle. Mm. If you love chocolate, you're gonna love this. Mm. Chocolate, I said chocolate, coconut loaf. I like coconut flavor. So it's not like the book coconut, like a big chunk of coconut. But you can see coconut flakes at the top of the bread. And then you can taste it. This is the sardine flavor. You can see sprinkles of sardine on it. Like the chicken flavor, you can see the sardine is inside the bread. So I'm just taking a slice. I like to squeeze this bread, fold it, and press it. That's how to eat soft peel of bread. This is it. This is my favorite. Mm. The battle is between the chicken and the sardine bread. The battle for me. Mm. Because on the normal day, people eat bread and sardine, you know. So this one is banging. I like the sardine bread. My favorite are the sardine and the chicken. Mm. I need more. Look at the sardine. This bread is on to fry egg. You see this hole in the middle with the sardine? I want to put the egg inside, like fried egg, put it inside, then press it and just eat. That's what I want to do. And that's what I want to do the rest of the food. Well, let me finish this one. I'll finish this look by myself right here, right now. This is how I eat bread, you guys. I don't like the outside of bread. Some people, this is their favorite part of bread. For me, this is not my favorite. My favorite is the middle. I dip my hand inside bread like this and I take it out. And I know it used to annoy my mom so much. There was one day, my mom bought one big loaf of bread. She was in the car. I just dipped my hand inside, I took everything. The hot slap I chopped that day, you guys. They turned and reset my brain. My belly is full with bread. I've just tasted all four loaves. 
and like I said my favorite is the sardine and then the chicken and then the I don't know between the chocolate and the coconut I like both of them I like all of them because the bread it's so soft and it doesn't have like a bad aftertaste there there are some breads that you taste and it has like this aftertaste but this one is not like that and i feel like one loaf of bread is good for one human being even though some people will be like it's too much one loaf of bread is good for one person i can finish one loaf i don't know about you um and these are like medium sized loaves this is half of a loaf so i mean me i can finish it or maybe because <laughs> because i'm breastfeeding that's why i'm eating a lot but anyways i really enjoyed myself today i enjoyed this bread and i'm going to still have some more for tomorrow till it finishes anyway hope you guys enjoyed my review if you're around that area in yaba you should check out my breadish like it's on the road you cannot miss it it's like red and white and they're playing loud music so you cannot miss it if there's somewhere cool in your area like a nice restaurant somewhere to eat anything involving food share or just street food just let me know and if i'm in that area i'm going to check it out it's not every day i go to yaba and today i've had this one in my mind for like two months now and i said anytime i go to yaba i'm going to review this place and i'm so glad i've taken it off my list so i'm looking for more places to explore i'll see you guys in my next video bye